Hello, cosmonauts. It's me, Esh, back in Galactic Wrath. And as you can see, it is again completely fucking different because I uh, I had to start over after after all. There was a there's so many ores that were replaced in the Earth by like machines and stuff like that, where I, it would have been impossible for me to get any sort of real ore after the update that ruined all the item numbers, item IDs rather. So I rebuilt it on a new world. I, I say I rebuilt, it's totally different. I, I didn't want to go into it too much. I just made a square building, a lot of lamps. It's kind of ugly, to be honest. I, I kind of hate it. <laughs> but by the time I realized I hated it, it was basically already finished. Um, if you take a look, I've got some tanks inside. This is my favorite part, actually. i got tanks inside. I've got water and oil. I've already pumped out all the oil from that oil spout that was over there. And... Then in the middle, I've got my machines that we had before, and then outside, if you go outside this way, I've got the little launch pad area. Um, this gun doesn't have any power, but I'll power it later, and that's all I've got. So, so um, this episode, what I think we're going to do is, because we have some oil, I figure we might as well start refining it into fuel for our rocket. So, with that said, let's take a look and see what refinery actually costs to make. Copper canisters, compressed steel, furnace, and stone. Copper canister is just that. Okay, that's pretty easy. Um, I have four chests over here. Uh, let's see. Got some steel. Got some copper. And uh, we're going to need some stone, which I think we have some cobblestone over in one of these. Yes. And we're going to need to make a furnace. We'll make two furnaces. And also, we don't have a freaking crafting bench. So I forgot that, obviously. And I'm going to make one of those. Four. Alright, let's make a crafting bench. And... Put that... Where should we put it? Put it right here. Okay. So we need... Two furnaces should be good. One for the recipe. And one for actual use. And we'll put the furnace here. And now we need to make copper canisters. Two of them right there. And then we need to compress the steel. Which is great. Okay. Uh, we need to think. Yeah, two of those. Uh, let's go ahead and get some some um, coal, put it in the furnace, and make some, oh shit, smooth stone is what I wanted, there we go, alright, two smooth stone, oh, this is going to be pretty easy, except we're going to have to run some wires over to it in order to make it work, power it, so... Actually, we can just put it right here. I'm stupid. We'll just put it right here somewhere. Maybe even on top of this bad boy. Actually, what I wanted to do was actually make it, put it right here, so that the oil could be pumped out of it. Because the oil is going to be pumped out from the bottom, and it'll come up and come right here. So we might as well put the refinery there. So I do have some aluminum. Oh yeah, speaking of uh, aluminum, actually this has nothing to do with aluminum, but um, how's your holidays? Was it was it good? Did you have a good holiday season? I uh, popped up the final episode of the first look at the Divinity Original Sin Alpha test. So if you guys haven't checked that out, go ahead and do it. So part three finale, finale, and um, it's a pretty fun game. It's definitely an alpha, and it's hard to really get invested in it because you know that it's going to probably be wiped at some point, but it's still fun, and I'm looking forward to playing it in beta and stuff. Uh, and actually, I really put it up because... Shit, i got to get this stone out. Because I needed some time to rebuild this again, and uh, I didn't want to do it all in one day because I did that the last time, and I having to do that again would have been a suicide attempt. Oh, look at this. Refinery. A blue text. What a what a son of a bitch. This is going to be the best. Alright, let's put the refinery right here. Oh, look at this. 
Looks amazing. Looks amazing. Okay. So red is for input of power. Uh, maybe we should reverse that bad boy, even though it looks cool. This looks alright, though. Wait a minute. Oh, the red's on the top. I'm dumb. The red is on the top, so we need to power it from the top. Let's pop it down. Put a wire here. And go. Go with it. Alright, we need to hook it in to this one. I feel like it should go up, you know? So it does not run across the floor for us to jump over it all the time. Alright, let's do it. Let's fucking do it. Actually, you know what? Shit. I need to do that. I'm gonna jump on top of it. One more. That's fine right there. I've, 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 I'm at the point where I've foregone making everything look good like I was in the last three or four attempts. So at this point, I'm just like, fuck it, let's run wires floating in the air to wherever we need them. Because, goddamn, I just want to go to space. I know you guys feel the same way. Alright, let's uh, break this last wire. It's too much. Now let's run it down. There we go, that should work. And we can run this up. Or over, this run over. There we go. And we'll run this down. There we go, it's all hooked up. And we got power out the butt. Alright, so let's go ahead and... Oh shit, you know what? We may not have any pipes. I may have not have saved because I had to spawn all the stuff in to make up for the fact that I had to restart. Uh, oh shit, you know what? No, what to do here? Should I spawn some in, or should I try to make some? I don't know that we have any cac. Oh yeah, we do have some. Let's go ahead and not cheat. Let's stop cheating. It'd be easy to justify it, but let's try not to cheat anymore for the rest of the series. Um, I'm gonna stop upgrading the freaking pack, and uh, until we're done with this season, at least. If this race is going to take an entire season just to get to the moon, then we can make another season to get to Mars. Uh, this mod pack has an extra planets pack. I think it adds extra planets to the whole thing, which could be interesting. Um, I left, uh, as I may have mentioned last time, I left bios of, biomes of plenty off. Otherwise, these cactuses would have been impossible to find. Oh shit, this guy. He wants to get fresh. You know what? He is fresh to death. Okay, let's go back now. I've got 18 cacti. And I'm gonna get this actually on our way back too. Might as well. There we go. I've got some sugar conus. Some sugar conus and um for no reason other than the fact that we don't have any right now. Alright, so this is going well, everybody. Luckily. Oh shit, look at this fucking guy. He's gonna blow up this. There we go. It's fine. Look at the ugly whirlpool you made. We got ourselves an armed and dangerous zombie here. Just gonna take one. Oh, you fucking asshole. This is why you don't adventure at night, everybody. I don't know why we keep. I keep doing, doing it. I've been playing in Minecraft for years and years, and it's still... Oh, look at this fucking little baby armored zombie. What the hell? It's like my nightmare is coming to life. I need to get back up. Oh my god, fuck this, I'm killing it. Come here, you little shit. You want it? Oh, I'm gonna die. I am going to die. This baby zombie is gonna murder me. Oh my god, die! I need to get away from this. Oh! I've escaped. That was intense. I nearly died there. Two hearts. Jeez, oh. that was way more exciting than I wanted it to be. Okay, so we've got these. We gotta cook these in the furnace. 
We're going to need some sand as well for cooking. Um, let's go ahead and get... We have some coal in here. Let's go ahead and put the coal in the furnace. Let's go ahead and get some food, actually. Take these apples. There we go. That should help. And I'll put this up. Let's open this wrong one. And what are we going to do now? Um, we are cooking the cactus and the cactus green dye. And we need to go get some sand. Um, what else do we have in our stuff here? Nothing really that we can use. Alright, so we're going to have to just man up. Jump down in this hole and get some sand. Uh, Alright, so we're going to get some dirt as well while we're down here because I'm going to need to build a little staircase up to that platform back there from the outside. Otherwise, we're going to have to do that. I just ate full health and I'm, and I'm already down to down a half a heart because apples are terrible. Should have learned that by now. Alright, so let's see. If I sound uh, a little bit off, it's because holidays, you know, just one of those things. Not much you can do about it. Alright, um, we're going to go over here, we're going to build a little staircase of dirt and hope that nobody follows us up, even though this creeper is looking very, very suspicious. All right, we're just going to put it right over this ice. up. We got some sand to cook using the glass and maybe some cobblestone. I think that's what we're using to make some pipes and then waterproof them. That's enough. That's enough of that. Let's put that and let's check and see under here. Okay, we got ourselves... Do we really need this pump? Uh, do we really need a wooden pipe down there for a pump? I don't really know. Uh, we'll test it. We'll put a we'll put a cobblestone pipe there, and see if we actually need it. I think we're going to need it, but that also means we need to get another engine, which I'm tempted to just take from here. This one doesn't seem to be on at all, and it's doing fine actually. <laughs> I don't know what the hell about that's about. Right, I'm gonna just break it and then jump down after it. Holy shit! This is deeper than I thought. I may actually drown, which would be hilarious. Oh, there's the lever. I kind of want to get that lever. Diving back down. Where was it? There it is. Okay, we got the lever. It's actually daytime now, so we don't have to worry about getting uh, our butts our butts twiddled by uh, zombies and skeletons and spiders and all manner of other actually un just the most tedious things ever in a game so that's good now we can go over here in peace climb up our little dirt staircase of ugliness which is actually the hideous the most hideous staircase ever built pop up it and get back inside and then we can we now have an engine which should slowly but surely pump out oil if needed because I want to I still want to test you know, I wish I would've... It's it's cool that it's floating over water, but at the same time, I wish I kind of could go down there and work on the pipes and stuff without sinking to the bottom of the abyss. Alright, so I'm just going to place this up if I can. Shit. Okay, I'm going to have to go down there probably. Uh, Alright, let's see. We got, we got our glass going. Let's go get this cobble first. Do we have any cobble? We have cobble. Okay. We got our glass is done. And this goes in the middle. Find there. Got so oh shit. 64 more. Um, 64. And then. Uh, oh yeah, we have to make this into this pipe sealant. And there we have 12 fluid pipes. Perfect. Okay. Um, now I'm guessing we have to put this on the side, on one of the sides. 
Let's see, this is going to be oil, so I imagine this side is where we pump it in. Why is this wire connecting to that? I have no idea. It doesn't need to, but it's fine. Alright, we got there. It looks as though we're going to have to climb down, or jump into this water and do some aquatic fixing. Okay, that's done. Oh, look at this. The oil is actually going on its own. This is amazing. Okay. That's a great turn of events. I'm Every time I jump down here, I'm regretting not putting more than one doorway on the building. But you know what? Safety first, everybody. Safety first. Alright, so we're going to go back in. Hopefully this thing is going to be refining by the time we get in there. And we're going to have a little bit of fuel to show for our efforts today. Oh, that's going to be best. Oh, you know what? I forgot. I made a checklist. So I'm going to bring that up and we're going to go over it and see what we got to do. Now this is the part one of part of two part checklist. This is the mandatory stuff that you need to go into space. And then there's going to be a part two checklist which is all the other optional stuff. But really so much of this stuff is really imper uh, imperative to have that it almost is mandatory to have. Um, so let's take a look at the checklist before we check the fine refinery out. Alright, so we're looking at the Galacticraft Moon Mission Checklist, codename Starfucker. <laughs> as you can see, we have quite a few things, and this is, as uh, you can see, part one of two. Um, we have done the launch pad, so we can mark that out, and we can also mark out the um, fuel, because that was supposed to say refinery, but I, I'm a scrub. Um, so we can mark out those second and third on the lists, so let's do that. Great, now we are looking at a tier 1 rocket, which is the ultimate uh, fuel loader, oxygen tanks, gear, and mask, some standard gear and armor, um, and tools and so forth, and then a means of return, which could mean a teleporter, it could mean coming back with a rocket ship, it could mean uh, any number of things, we have to think about that, that'll probably be the last thing we do on this list, and then we'll go on to part 2. All right, so there's the checklist, which we can we've removed refinery from. Let's check it out. And see, no oil is what's happening here. Uh, maybe it's the wrong side. I don't know. Let's see. So I'm pretty sure this was the right on this side. Oh, there we go. Okay. Actually, I'm not sure if it's working. I think it's this side. Yeah, it looks to be that side that's getting emptied. Oh no! Oh well, I'm not going down there. So it just takes a minute to recognize that oil's going in. Um, we've got this going. Uh, status is ready. Refine. I guess we can just hit refine and it'll refine it. Let's do it. Oh shit, look at this. Oh, it's working everybody. It is actually functioning correctly. That, oh, that's awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So, now, I guess we should note that there are two refineries. One is for a different mod pack. This one is actually meant for Galacticraft, so I'm sure that this might work. But it is way more expensive with the diamond gear. And I'm not completely sold on the fact that it'll work for fuel for Galacticraft, so don't, don't bother really with it. I've got 240 units of refined fuel from this oil. Which is awesome, really. Alright, so... Oh, man. That's good. That is really good. So you guys saw the checklist. You know what we have to do. We, we've we we've got fuel. We have all sorts of other machines we need to make. So next time, we're really going to get down to business and start doing that sort of stuff. And I might set up the quarry again before now and then, but I really don't know if I'm going to set up a quarry again. It just, it's just, I'm a, I'm a jaded now for the quarry. I keep setting it up. I keep having tanks and stuff and pumps and all sorts of stuff specifically to power the quarry. And then I just have to start over or it blows up. I'm just uh, jaded at this point. So, until next time, I'm Ash. This is a short Galacticraft episode, but welcome back. It's been a little bit of a hiatus thanks to the holidays and all sorts of other stuff. But uh, we're going to go to space really soon. We got our checklist ready. Uh, if you guys have a suggestion on what I should build next from the checklist, then please leave a comment. If you like the series, hit the like button, and if you like the channel, hit the subscribe button. Play on!
Thank you.